to get my school shoes and some other stuff because I've got school tomorrow. Well, at least I get to see my friends. I had a great summer break and I'm about to do my last year of primary school or I think in America it's called elementary school. So I have to get some stuff all sorted out before I go back to school tomorrow. Hmm, I better try on my dress just to make sure it fits. Okay, I hope it fits otherwise mum's going to have to adjust it so then it fits me. Alright, let's try this dress on. It's fine, it fits perfectly. Alright, I'm just going to go right back into my normal clothes. I'm back. Alright, now what should I do? You know what, maybe I might go label all my books and my pencils. I'm just going to go get them right now. I might do this on my bed. Oh! I don't think I'm comfortable on the floor. That's okay. <laughs> all right, all in here are all my books and pencils. So I'm just gonna get them out. Okay. So in here, this is my books box where I keep all like my reading books for school. That's what I'll do. And in here, geez, it's like a a dozen of all these um um I'm writing books that I'm going to need for school. Some of them maybe homework books as well, and I need to label all these. All right, I'll put that over here. It's maybe like a writer's notebook or something. This is our school diary where we like write all the books that we've read and yeah. In here, I like probably word study um books. Here's some plastic pockets to put like empty sheets of work and stuff. Um, this is like a sketch pad for like where we can draw and stuff. Maybe do more word studies. And in here are some really big scissors. <laughs> and here I've got all of my like connector pens, textures, sorry. So I can't wait to use these. I love these type of um, textures. And there's the blue book box. Okay, what do we have in here? Oh, I've got my school labels. There we go, and a Sharpie pen. In here are all of like my stationery stuff. So I've got my colouring pencils. I've also got some highlighters for work. We use these a lot. Oh, these are some different coloured sticky notes. So here, here are some sticky notes that I'll need for work as well. We use those a lot. And what else? Oh, we've also got some erasers. Two white erasers. Uh, oh, what are these? We, we do a lot of like stuff on the whiteboard at school. So obviously I've got a red and a black um, whiteboard markers. And here I've got a yellow sharpener. Sorry if there's a lot of loud noises. I think my next door neighbours are in the pool. I should be in the pool as well. Oh well, I oh, maybe I can go in later. And in here I have oh, I've got three erasers. I didn't see that under all those. And here I have a whole heap of like blue pens and uh, red pens. We need these for, like marking ticks and stuff. And a whole lot of grey lead pencils. Okay, I've got a bunch of glue sticks. We go through these, like, I don't know how fast. <laughs> here we go. And lastly, in here, I've got some more exercise books. These are, like, you know, for history classes and that. And I've also got some folders. I've got a red one and a green one. And in here I've got two like sort of like plastic pockets as well. I've got like all these things in here for like work. So that's all that's in this box. <sighs> Alright, well it looks like 
I'm gonna have to label all of these. Okay, what should I start off with? You know what? I think I might start off with writing my names on all of these. This is gonna take a while. Where is it? Okay. I have to write Grace Mulgrew on all of his books. And let's go. Grace Mulgrew. First one down. Um, 12 more to go. <laughs> diary as well. I don't want to get them mixed up at school. Alright, I never knew how hard it was to write your name like 50,000 times. Okay, now that I've finished writing my name on things, I think I'm going to start using these labels for these books, I think. Alright, they're really cute, these labels. They've got like little Paris stickers on them. It's much easier than writing your name. I think I might use the Eiffel Tower. Okay. Ooh. That looks good. All right. Luckily, there's not as many exercise books as books as like what I just labelled before. Okay, now I think I might label all of my folders as well. Do the green one first, and I think I might do the Eiffel Tower. I love that sticker. Now I need to sort out my pencil case. Oh, everything's on the bed now. I got this really cute pencil case for Christmas and it says a lot of inspirational words on it. And I think it will be really cute to use for school this year. I have to label all of these now, so let's get started. There's the first one and a lot more to go. You know what? I'll be, I've got so many to do, I think I might cut this right now and I'll be right back, okay? <laughs> oh, finally finished. I think I need another holiday now just from doing all this. Alright, well now I'm just going to be packing my pencil case. So I'm just going to unzip this. Okay. So I'm not going to take everything to school and I'm just going to leave some of them behind, just, you know, for like spares and stuff. So for now I think I might take two blue pens and two red pens to school and I'll leave the rest. I'll also take two pencils and a yellow sharpener, one eraser, it says GM on the bottom, and I'll also take my um, text whiteboard markers. <laughs> okay, I'm just thinking I'll take, hmm, I'll take this glue stick and now what else? I'll also take all of my highlighters. I've got a green one, a yellow one, a pink one and also a blue one. And they can go right in there. What else? Alright, I think, oh yeah, sorry, also my scissors I need. This is says Grace M. No, I think that's all for the top pencil case. It's pretty cool. And here it's really big so it can fit a lot of stuff in. Um, so in here I will put all of my colouring pencils. That took a long time to label those so I put a lot of effort into those. And in here I'll put in all of my colouring textures. Oh yeah, and also my post-it notes, or sticky notes. Okay, I think that's pretty full for now, um, and that's all for this. I think I might go 
unpack my school bag now. But before I do that, I just wanted to show you guys my school shoes. Don't you think they're cute? I think they're cool. Alright, well, I have to go get my school bag now. Okay, well, I've got my school bag here, and it seems like Madison really wanted to help me pack. Don't you, Madison? It seems like she does. Okay, well, I'm just going to sit her down right here, and she can organise some other stuff. Okay, so firstly, I'm just going to take out everything from my bag. Ah, oh, I forgot I had all these um, gel pens I was going to use for school. I think I might put these in my pencil case. There we go. Um, I've also got my umbrella, Hello Kitty umbrella, in here. It's really cute when I open it up. Um, just in case it rains in the winter time, even though it's summertime here, and it should not be raining. The Melbourne weather, you just don't know. Oh, and in here I've got a bunch of key rings that I'll put on my bag later. Okay, now that I've got my bag all unpacked, I'm going to put all my school books in here. I don't really take, again, like, I could not all the books, so I don't really take them to school, so I'm just going to maybe take about four. I'll take about four and leave the rest for home just when I need them. What's next? I think I might take two of my Megasaurus books and put them in here. As well. Okay, um, what else do I need? Hmm. Alright, I think I might take one folder if it fits in my bag. Ah, perfect fit. Uh, one sketch pad. One of these, like, one of these reading books, or writing word books. And my diary, I'm definitely going to need this. And I think I might, I don't think I'll need these for now. I might take these later in the year, but maybe I might take my plastic pockets just in case. Okay, well now that I've got all that in here, um, I think I might, I think it might be time to put my pencil case in. I'm not going to have a lot of fun carrying, carrying this into school. It's going to be very heavy. Hopefully Dad can help me. <laughs> and I've also got my Hello Kitty umbrella that I'll put right in here. Okay, I think that's all for my school bag. Alright. Oh yeah! Silly me, I almost forgot to show you guys that I brought my stuff from Seagull. Alright, what's in here? Oh yeah. The first thing in here is my lunchbox that I'm going to use for school. It's really handy and it's going to fit a lot of stuff in. So, if I unzip this, it has a small... The zip is stuck. I hate it when that happens. And I can put some, maybe some brain food or even some ice in there to cool my stuff. And it's really cute. It has like these like little cupcakes and stuff on the front. It's so cute. Everyone's going to want my lunchbox at school. And down here, it's more of a bigger part where I can put my sandwich or like fruit snack. Alright, so that was my lunchbox. And what else do I have in here? Oh, this is my favourite. This is my water bottle. It's so like squishy. I don't know how they put water in here, but it does. <laughs> and it's a straw just goes up. Oh, did you hear all that air going out? <laughs> I think it's like a really fun water bottle. There we go. I'm just going to put this in the side of my bag. There we go. Medicine didn't seem very comfortable. Oh yeah, I also got this really cute key ring that has a G on it. Oh. There we go. I don't know what's inside of it, but it's really cute. But this one's going to put that in my pile over there. This is my favourite. It, it's like a cupcake scented um, pencil. Oh, sorry. Um, it's like a vanilla or cupcake scented thing. It's got a really cute eraser at the top with like a cupcake. And that even smells good. Oh, 
I don't think I'll be doing my work at school. I think I'm going to be sniffing this pencil the whole time. Uh, I'll put that in my pencil case later. So that's all from Sniggles. And I also went to Kiki K and I got some other stuff as well. So in here I got some like adhesive note set that I'm going to probably need for school to write down notes. In here I got two planners, journals. Um, so like it's like a daily study thing so that way I'm not all stressed in the morning. Not all stressed, I can look back at this and make sure that I didn't forget anything or write down any notes. And this does the same, it's got like all the days of the week on it. It's really colourful and I think it will match well with my desk. I'm not going to bring this to school, it's going to be too big, but it's good to have at home. And this stuff I did get from Kitty K, but I didn't know where else to put it. This is like another notebook, it's got like it's dotty and it's got like all these um, like lines down here so that way I can sort it out like a homework I can put here, I'd like write on all these so that way I'm even more organised. And lastly I got these, oh they're super cute, I got these two erasers, I got like a rubber duck, it's so cute, I love the little mouth, and also three teddy bears, one orange, green and pink. Their faces are so adorable. Alright Madison, are we ready to put some key rings on? I think she said yes. Okay, now, oh, that is heavy. Madison's just going to pass me all my key rings. Thank you. Now, um, I'm going to put all the key rings on my bag now because it just makes the bag look so much better. So here I've got um, like a really cute ladybug on it and it says Grey Smolger on it. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to put it here. I always get confused on how to put these sort of type of key rings on. I think I've got I've had this one since like I was in kindergarten. It's so cute. There we go. Also, my friend got me this key ring from New York and it's so cute. I love it. It's like pink and I love that. Yeah, I love it. <laughs> and I'm just going to put this on my zipper. I hate these style of key rings. They're so hard to get on. There we go, got that one on pretty easy, better than I expected. And this one's from Hawaii, when I went to Hawaii I got this one, it says Aloha on it, it's so cute. Oh my gosh, now I was thinking about this, just really well, it's me to go, now I really want to go to Hawaii now. No I said I have to go to school. Right, that fits on nice and snug. And I've got two more, oh, no, I've got three more. This I got it from the Madame Dressort. Um, it's really cool. I need like sunlight, I think, to do this. But like, it goes like dark and it pops out. Grace, it's so cute. And how am I gonna get this one on? I think I'm gonna have to put this one on later. It's just I can't put it on. <laughs> what else do I have? Oh, I've also got this Eiffel Tower one. I know I haven't been to France, but my cousins have, and they got me this. That way I can remind myself of friends. Um, I'm just thinking where I should put this one. You know what? I'll just put it next to that. No, actually I changed my mind. I want to put it on the zipper. I used to have like a pink Eiffel Tower on there, but then it fell off and I was so unhappy. There we go. And this, lastly, is the one from Smeagol. The, at that one. And what I'm going to do with this, I think I'm just going to have to put it right here. Jeez, I had a lot less key rings this year. I used to have like, I don't know how many, but so many on my bag. Finally got that one on. Alright, Madison and I have finished getting ready for school. Um, so now, what am I going to do with the last few hours for my summer break? Of course, I'm going to go in the pool now. Pool time! It's raining! Why do you want that? 